Do you hate the looks of your boring ATM cards? Well, in this video, I will show you how to create personalized ATM skins for your boring ATM cards. Alright, so let me take you now to Photoshop. And as you can see here, I already have created a template for your ATMs. Now, what I did here is that I actually scanned one of my uh, cards, uh, one of my, you can scan one of your ATM cards uh, and then put it in Photoshop and you can trace it uh, using the pen tool. But if you want to use the same template that I am using, I can give it to you for free. Uh, just uh, send me a message or send me an email uh, to picture this at vinsamba.com or support at vinsamba.com all right so this is again our template now i will make uh, my own since i work on a cruise ship i would actually like to create a skin which is which has a cruise ship background so i have chosen already um, a photo for that so it's actually in here so first i will put here a wonderful wonderful cruise ship this is actually the wonder of the seas and uh, all you have to do when you place the image all you have to do is to create a clipping mask so it would clip on the template well of course this one for me looks boring so i would uh, actually put my name on it just like so i already created this earlier guys so uh, you can do so by yourself um, it's very easy to create text in photoshop so after the name I would also create or I would put my uh, position on board just like that and then of course since I work for Royal Caribbean International I'll be putting the Royal logo it's okay there you go so I just put there the Royal Caribbean logo okay and of course just to spice things up I'll be putting up here a logo of the MasterCard so that looks good I'll be saving this Okay, again, guys, uh, we will be sending this image to a uh, Silhouette Studio so that our Cameo 4 would cut out this print. So again, before we can send that to our Silhouette Studio, all we have to do is to save this as PNG. All right, so all you have to do is hold Control Alt S, choose PNG here, and then I already saved this earlier. Okay. Now, uh, I want to create because I have a lot of these boring ATM cards right here in front of me. I will be also creating a different one. I was actually thinking of creating uh, the Hunter X Hunter license card. So I already have created a design for that. I created it in Adobe Illustrator. So uh, I and I already put it in here. So let me just close this out, and then let me open the hunter x hunter card like this so again if you want this design uh, this is already saved as png as well if you want this i can give this to you for free all you have to do is send me an email or comment down on the or just comment down below you know okay so i want to create also a skin for this uh, robinson card here as a Hunter x Hunter license card. Alright, let's save that as PNG. Control Alt S PNG. And then again, I already saved this earlier. Okay. Now again, I also want to create another skin for my GCash card. So let me just remove that. I again created already a design that's on my mind earlier. I'll be actually creating uh something like this so again guys by the way uh since my gcash card has a smart chip in here uh we need to have a uh what do you call this a hole in here so that our cameo uh, silhouette studio can also cut this out and you don't have to cut it using scissor so uh, again that's our template and then again i have uh chosen a picture this is this picture is actually taken on board Oasis of the Seas on my first contract that was way back 2017. 
All right. So again, I'll be um, putting on my name and of course my position right now on board. And again, I will put Royal Caribbean logo to spice things up. And of course, the MasterCard logo in here. Okay, that looks good for me. I will save this again as a PNG. There you go. And again, I have saved this earlier. Again, guys, don't forget to save this as PNG so that it will be cut by your uh, Cameo 4 nice and easy. All right, click on save. Now, so I have three designs now. Um, let me just see if I, because I have four ATM cards in here. So, and maybe I want to create one for my wife. So let me see. And uh, for this example, I'll be using uh, pictures of my son and daughter. So first, let's do here. Um, again, guys, I'll be using here a template without the, the hole here. Uh, because I, uh, I check her cards and I'll be using one uh, for, for a card without the, just like this, without the smart chip, okay? So, uh, let's put in here the picture of my son and then all you have to do is to create clipping mask so it would clip on the template, just like so. That looks good for me, as good as good looking as me. Okay. Let's save this document. Again, save it as PNG. Let's just say my son. And of course, make sure to save it save it as large file size. Click OK. After that, um, let's use this one. Well, if you have pictures like this, doesn't really because if you actually um, clip this on the template it would look like that so we need to edit this picture first so how to do that let me just release the clipping mask and first we need to fix this um, the shirt Just like so, that's that's fine. Now, let's make this a little bit bigger. And then let's clip that on our template. Just like that. Okay, that looks good. Let's save this as again a PNG file. And let's just say daughter. Click save. Now, again, we will be sending this to our Silhouette Studio application so and we will be using an a4 vinyl sticker so before i send this to silhouette studio i will be creating a new document an a4 size document portrait and of course it should be 300 dpi a4 size click create now i'll be dropping the pictures that we've created earlier the png files just like so. So for our A4 size document, guys, we can create maximum of eight ATM skins. So again, it will be really up to you. You can personalize this one and make sure to check your cards. If you see a smart chip in here, then you need to have uh, the hole for that, for the smart chip. And again, for this one, uh, for cards that doesn't have a smart chip, then don't put a hole in the middle. As easy as that. Okay, no, not really in the middle. It's on the side. On the left side. Okay. But again, let's move on. Uh, let's save this again as a PNG. I'll be removing the background so that the Silhouette Studio can cut this without the white background. So just turn it off just like that. Very quick. In Photoshop again make sure it's on a large file size click OK and let's open up silhouette studio again we will be printing this document guys in iTech 
vinyl sticker. I was also using a quaff before, but if you've seen my previous tutorial on how to print uh, photo stickers, I actually, uh, it features the difference between the iTech and the quaff vinyl stickers. And I always suggest using this one, guys, the iTech vinyl stickers. And if you want to know the reason why, just check on my video. It's somewhere around my channel. Um, again, it's about uh, photo printing or uh, painting stickers in vinyl. Okay. So here again is our Silhouette Studio uh, interface, user interface. First off, let's make sure that our paper is A4. And then let's also check in our paint page setup. Make sure it's on A4. Just like that. Click OK. And then after that, I'll be opening up the document that we've saved earlier. ATM cards and the ATM skin sample. Let's make sure it's in the middle. Um, if you want more tutorial, guys, about uh, Silhouette Studio, how to use it, uh, you can search YouTube or I can do one for you. Just if you want one, uh, just give me a comment, uh, send a request, send, an e send me an email, a comment down below so I'll know what you need, okay? So again, let's put that in here. Make sure to turn on registration marks. I'll always put inset to the minimum so we can fit our picture in here. And then again, let's make sure that it fits on the red uh, rectangle because this is um, this is the line where uh, the Silhouette Studio can cut your paper or the vinyl sticker. So make sure that the image is inside that red rectangle. Okay. Again, I've mentioned before that the red uh, the red lines, these are the lines that will be cut by your Silhouette Studio or with your machine, the Cameo 4. So again, here there is no smart chip hole for this 4 and we have 4 on this one. That looks good. Let's go back to the design tab. And from mm -hmm. here, we will print this document. So hit Control P, apply and print. Okay. All right. So let's just wait for our printer to finish printing our document again guys this is very easy to do and again you can personalize your own design okay so the printer is done printing the document and it looks like this wow i'm telling you it looks really 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 nice okay so since i don't have here um my other camera i'll i'll just show it to you in this main camera guys um again we will be Placing this uh, print out here in our cutting mat. Let's put this aside and let's use a squeegee. Uh, the Soloit Studio will actually register this, uh, the so called registration marks. Okay, so that's that. I'll be placing this now to my Cameo 4. That looks good. Again, I have created a um, a preset for iTech Matte Vinyl Sticker. Uh, the blade is on 2, force is 10, pass is 1, and the speed is 5. Click send. And let's just wait for the uh, Cameo 4 to cut our print, our ATM or personalized ATM skins. Okay, let me show you how it looks. Okay, so our Kameo 4 has finished cutting our document. Let's uh, take it out. And now it looks like this. I'm very excited. Now let's see. Guys, before actually you cover your um, ATM cards, make sure to take note of the information in front of the card because again, you will not be able to see it unless you remove the ATM skin. So for this purpose, I'll be taking a quick picture of the front 
of my ATM card, of my GCash card. Okay. And let's just use a squeegee. Okay, there you go. This is now our GCash card personalized with a Royal Caribbean cruise ship. That looks nice. Okay, let's do the same on the Abbey cards. Look at this! From the boring uh, Pagibig uh, ATM card, now we've personalized it with my picture and with the ship at the back. Really, really nice, guys. I love this. Okay, so if this video has helped you or if you have learned something new in this video, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you'll be um, notified for the upcoming videos that I'll be uploading in my channel. And of course, if you have any questions regarding this, please don't uh, hesitate to send me a message or comment down below. Alright, thank you so much you guys for watching this video and I'll see you on my next one. Bye!